the scales. Hmm, blade's getting pretty good. Light footed, sneaking, and nimble. All of the agility things are pretty much what you want. I never go for sprinting though, because I don't use it a lot. It makes a lot of noise. Blade real is really good because I believe it also makes you attack faster. Uh, you want all these too. But I have done a lot of cooking actually. I wish I could, but oh wait, did I forget one of my bags? Yes, I did. Let's put that away. Uh, sorry about that, guys. But I guess I forgot. I'm gonna actually try and make some soup tomorrow. Maybe if life permits me to. There. Sometimes it highlights the wrong one, so I get a little bit confused, but. I've already worked out which one it's doing most of the time, so. It's fine with me. Okay, well, I guess it's time for our time speed up. Yes. And now we wait. Usually, when the time evens off, it's around 7, my character wakes up. But, you know, these things flip flop the boat. Okay. Um, I believe that I want a pot. Um, yeah, pour in the water bottle. Uh, and then just grab the carrots. I believe you just go ahead and make boring soup. Uncooked boring soup. Yeah, and then you just cook it. As I recall. I've never actually made soup before in this game. Turn on and just wait. And the icon actually freaking turns red when you're cooking it, which is awesome. See, look at that. It's shading in slowly. I just love that. The amount of detail put into this is awesome. Okay. And then you just wait until it's uh, cooked. Boring soup. Boring soup, boring soup. Oh. I think they actually have active changing up it, so. This is one way for me. Not sure if they do, though. That's why I keep changing it back. Huh. That soup is... Puts on sunglasses. Pretty boring. Oh, yeah. Oh, cut. oven. Although there is no fire in the current version of the game, there will be one day. And when there is, yeah, that's really good. I'll eat the boring soup. Yeah, eat it all. I think you can actually put it in bowls, but I, I'm not going to do that. Well, I will reuse the pot, I believe. Wow, I've never actually eaten boring soup, so I guess it must be really good. Um, put the pot of water away. Okay, it's good. I eat all the perishables first. It's uh, easier that way for when everything starts going bad. Okay, no hordes standing directly outside my house. Time for the morning check of perimeter. Okay, there's still a guy over there. Doesn't seem to be anyone in this area, even though last time caused a pretty big commotion with killing these things. Okay, now let's check on the horde across the street. They seem to be hanging around still. 
Okay. Well, I'm going to go down here, check farther down the road. Uh, I assume there'll be another house? But I'm not 100% sure. I mean, I've explored most of the town. I know there's another house. I'm just lying to keep this more entertaining. But, you know. You gotta do what you gotta do. And... Oh, wait. Is there a war there? Equestrians? Yes, there is. Well, a small horde. But still a horde. Hordes you void at all costs. Okay. So I looted that house down there. Looks like this house is the next one. I left that open, right? I can't even tell from here. Hmm. Let's check if the door is open. Hmm. Any other zombies? Okay. I think I can take this out. These two out. Sort of have to expect them to just turn around at uh, any number of things. Because sometimes characters aren't as good at sneaking and stuff. Usually as long as the other zombies are in the streets or something, I figure it's fine. Okay, I'm gonna get in through this curtain then. Usually the windows farthest away are the ones easiest to uh, break in through. Good, good. It's still always a risk just being in a house because all the zombies in the house are usually just in fact walking around. Or well, that actually sometimes, or no, it's a rare occurrence, but it does happen. So, oh, what door did I open down here? Okay. It's always, it, uh, this game keeps you on edge because it's like zombies everywhere and, and uh, they corner you, you're dead. And you, trust me, do not want to be dead in this game. I mean, aside from it uh, being a pretty unsatisfying feeling, it's also like, it, it sort of ruins more of the save file, but also makes it more interesting. Because, I mean, I don't mean that. Because, if you, uh, keep the save file that you're currently on, or what I'm trying to say, mm. yeah, if you keep the save file, uh, down. if you keep the save file, and you, yeah, I'm getting all this disorganized and stuff, sorry, but yeah, if you keep the save file and stuff, then all the zombies you've killed are gonna still be corpses on the round. And your character, I believe, is also dead on the ground. So, I mean, and the world's sort of uh, looted-ish. I'm not sure if they restock it, but I don't know, it just makes it like sort of used as a world, you know? Sorry, didn't mean to put you down. Grab what's in the fridge now. I make sure to keep it separate. My food and supplies and stuff. Goodness gracious! I know this probably isn't the most interesting thing to be doing in LP on, considering it's like survival and stuff. But it's, well, I mean, it's not really an LP much either. I'm planning four episodes, but I'm gonna mix it up. I'm gonna put a Skyrim in there, hopefully. Uh, yeah. Oh, another school bag. The totes carry 15 also, so it doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, I don't think I need any of them. Someone made a mod for silence and uh, pistols. 
that involves just having a pillow. It's pretty useful. But I've never installed it until I don't I know, I'm sorry. It sounds like it's useful though, is what I'm sort of trying to say. And, uh, let's see. One of these totes is unfilled. One is filled. It will discern and transcend. Yes, that is the one with all my stuff. Duffel bags are the best. That's the reason why. Oh no. Put that there. Okay. I usually wear the vest, but it's rainy season, so. It's better to dress your character warmly while you're uh, walking about trying to survive, you know? Ooh, medicine. Ooh, ooh actual medicine. You barely ever find medicine in these things. It's interesting. Uh, no. Oh. Yes. No. Okay. Well, that's fine. Switch over to this. I start carrying equipment around in my uh, duffel bag because later on you get to the sort of big warehouses. And those, it's extremely useful to sort of have your stuff in, yeah. That wasn't a good explanation. Okay, I'm sorry. But the, I don't know. I guess this game just takes a lot of my concentration, so I'm sorry if the sort of talking is worse than it usually is. And it's raining, so I'm going to get home pretty quick. Uh, yeah. Sometimes hordes surround your house too. So you sort of have to get uh, creative with picking the things off. Let's go over this way. One of these guys spots you, all of them go after you. It's a dangerous game playing in Project Zombie. Elite series, do two double oh one eight seven zero is the number I just said. Okay, well now that we're home, we get to fill up all my stuff. Also I need a drink. I think. I'm not sure. Yeah, my character gets, I think, a bit tireder and tireder every day, and it usually levels off around 7 for a wake-up period. And honestly, it's pretty bad for the zombie apocalypse. You'd think everyone would be waking up really early. I just noticed that I'm filling mugs with water. So, I'm gonna go ahead and just slap all these uh, away now. A lot of water. Lots of water are useful. I can carry a lot of water. If you are ever moving to a faraway place because you've lost all, uh, I don't know, I guess supplies and stuff. Huh, this is getting quite full. Oh, uh, but yeah, if you ever need a new place to run off to, usually you take a lot of your supplies. Because, like, sometimes you actually survive long enough to be able to loot the whole village. And so, you have to take to the road. I once found a little farm. I believe it was out of the ma main map. Because it didn't look like it was part of the main map to me. But, it could have been part of the main map, so who's to say? Or, well, yeah, I guess you guys could. If you guys found, like, um, a map with a farm on it as part of this game, then that would be appreciated, because then I'd know... If I did indeed find my way out of the town, or yeah, out of town, and then get into a randomly generated sort of farmy bit. But, you know, it's up to you totally. Totes, my brata. It is up to you to find the key to the ramen, chips, vitamins, painkillers. You don't find painkillers a lot, surprisingly. Which is interesting. Why? Well, 
See, pain pillows are actually one of the most useful things, especially for someone who is... I don't remember what it's called. Hypochondriac. Because they always think they're sort of infected-ish, I guess. And, I don't know. I guess they just sort of freak out and feel pain. Because you get a pain moodle if you think you're infected. And I'm not sure what that's all about. I did not find... I'm going to put the TV dinner in the fridge. Just because. Ooh. Gunshots in the distance. That could mean anything for me. Okay. Wow. Everything seems to be doing generally well. Now it's time to wait till sleep. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't feed myself much in the name of conserving food. But well I mean it's a zombie apocalypse is the excuse for everything. Peas. Can you cook them? No. Um hmm. I'll leave the soda for later. I'm thinking lemons right now. Sugar. It sounds like they're attacking the house. Hmm. I'm gonna wait until it's lighter out. from. Is that how I need to go outside? Maybe? Right. I hope there's no horde. Uh -huh. Ah, good. There he is. Uh, okay. So there is indeed not a horde, which is good. Huh. I need to keep clearing out my uh, safe house stuff. Maybe even a lot more than it was. Damn it. It's caught off guard by that guy. Ugh. My nose is so itchy. But, you know, that's because I'm talking to myself in the room alone. So sad. Oh my god. Okay. Bit more this way before I attack this guy. Thank you. Yes, uh, I'm gonna continue searching the houses down this way, but it's unlucky when the zombies start getting so big near your house because that means any day they could just find find you and then break in your home. Although, I'd probably try and retake that and die. Not an abs- Ah, oh, I forgot to empty that, didn't I? I forgot about all of them. It sounds windy. God, that's beautiful. They have a really nice, uh... Wind effects, actually. It was nice. It was actually windy recently in my house. I guess. I don't know, it sounds kind of weird coming off the tongue. It's like, it was recently windy in my house, yeah. The wind was blowing. It's a weather pattern, you know, so. I know it's a weather pattern. Okay, it doesn't matter if you think. It's just, uh, just natural things that happen. It's a weather pattern. It's the definition of a weather pattern right there. Natural things that happen. Like Chuck Norris. He's a weather pattern. Oh my god. Okay, well, I'm heading off this way a bit. That seems to be a horde. I don't want to attract the attention of a horde. Damn it! He got real close. Uh, 
Well, let's just check the perimeter, I guess, for the rest of it. I have slight damage, it seems. Although I haven't been bitten or anything. Maybe I'm getting cold. Well, I'm gonna check his shed, actually, first. I'm not sure if this is on this guy's property. Better not freaking have an alarm. Pencil, battery, empty mug. Empty mug I could use. Yeah, I'll leave it open. Have I tried the front door yet? It's a good question. Uh. Oh, good. It was indeed. Really? Uh, I'm gonna book it this way. I'm not gonna book it this way. Wow. This turned out badly. Turned out better, a little bit better. See, when you hear that alarm going, it means every zombie in the whole entire world is going to go in that house. No! God damn it. Did I get bitten or scratched? Freaking scary. Uh, well, I think I'm gonna wait for a couple days before I actually go down this road again. Uh, I hope that didn't draw a horde closer to my house. Because if so, I'd have to run them up and sort of kill them, I guess. I'd probably die though. I almost wanna like close that f loot button. Well, I guess I'm going to raid this house today. I'll have to settle for it. Let's go for this side. Hello? Damn it! Click! How am I not bitten yet? Jeebus. Seriously? That's weird. Ah, uh, but it seems Huh. What the okay. I was gonna say something actually. And I totally lost track of what I was going for. Baseball sheet rounds. Help this house with a gun. That could become useful very quickly. Um. Uh, need to put all the canned stuff and chips and such in there. Grab that. Grab this. This is a very organizational game, I guess you could say. But you don't really have to play it the way I'm doing it. I just think it's the smartest thing to do. Because you can waste a lot of time with uh, such things. You know, just organize them. Endlessly. Floods of motion. Spilling through every face in your body. Thank you. It's Palm by Jordan Sammy. Yeah. Okay. Um. Uh, 
put these. I don't know. I usually keep literature elsewhere. But I wasn't doing that before. I don't know. Some weird like that. Okay. Well, that seems to be all I can do for the day. Well, I mean, I'll probably do more. I'm just gonna retire though. To the bed. Uh oh. Keep thinking this chair is a zombie. How am I slightly damaged though? And why hasn't one zombie gotten a bite off on me yet? These are questions that need answers. Hmm. All these uh, canned things are actually pretty good. Especially if you have like um, a pot or something. It provides you with a lot of hunger. Meter up, I guess. I don't know. There's a weird sentence to finish, okay? Uh -huh. Slap all the rest in here. Thank you for taking so long, baseball pen. Really speeding things along, fine, pen. Why, thank you. I'm pretty sure it makes the lineup. Yeah, it does. I'm glad. Because that would be weird if I broke the game that way. Um, slap. Do I have any medicals? No, I don't believe I do. Well, let's check. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. I was going for this one. Because I have these things left. Good, good, good. Everything's working according to plan. Of death. And I have 30 rounds. Pretty awesome. Uh, let's take a bit to put away. They do. They do. They take a bit to put away. But it's not something to worry about, man. Not at all. So, I'm going to give you a short overview. This way is sort of. Uh, well, actually, there are two main directions. Um, I guess that's north. So if this were like straight instead of, uh, I can't remember what they called it, but it's some sort of view, then um, that would be north, that corner, or in the game, this is north. Uh, north, right, that is north, well, that ain't right. Uh, along this road, if you followed that road straight, you would be led into a lot more zombies than if you went the other way. So my plan is to just clear out the top bit. And then eventually work my way down and hopefully sneak or get my way into uh, the bottom bit because I just, uh, well, I don't have enough skill right now to actually go down there and raid anything. But I will be waiting until bedtime. these things happen in the background and you have to sort of deal with it I guess. Oh shit. Sounds like they broke in. A little bit. I will left my door open while I was sleeping. Sounds like they're breaking in more than a little bit. Well, now's the time to die. Why couldn't I see him? Come on. Come on. Come at me. Come at me. I dare you. Come at me, zombies. What? Why are they leaving? God damn it. I think I'm dead. Oh dear. I wish I had that gun for that last dance of the scenario. Okay. 
can you make your way in? Come on. You stupid Zambambies. It's right. This is the way I die. And this is the way I die. Hmm. Too many. Yeah. That. I didn't know it was staying this way. Holy shit, I fell into the house. Holy shit. Oh. They didn't last long. I survived for three days, 21 hours, sandbox. Put 76 zombies. 